Hey, Millie Chancellor. Sarah Gadama. Who is the loudest person in our squad? Oh, that's easy. Horse. Horse. Oh. Okay, like... Firstly, is your name Loretta or Loretta? Loretta, Loretta. <laughs> okay. 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 So, would you rather win a scrum penalty ten meters out from the try line yep. or score a try? Win a scrum penalty. Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's that's okay. That's Matt, would you rather your shirt to be two sizes too big or one size too small? Um, one too small. One too small. Yeah. <laughs> Then it'll be so tight. No, no, you got so known for that. <laughs> Pre-season was not easy. Uh, we did 12 weeks and 28 sessions and I found it incredibly hard and I know a lot of the girls did too. Um, but how do you feel coming out in the early end? I feel really good and I'm just excited for round one to start. Yeah, it's been a long season but I think we are ready Very and roaring prepared. to We're go. ready and roaring to go. <laughs> Roar! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> We know that being able to represent the Waratahs is something that we shouldn't take lightly and not that we do, but we feel very grateful. But to you, Bella, what does it mean to be able to don the sky blue and run out and represent your state? Um, it means a lot to me. I grew up supporting the Waratahs in every New South Wales team. I just love the state we live in and I'm so excited to represent not only my state, but my family as well and kids from the bush as well. So, yeah, that's so cool. And how do you feel about representing your state? I feel incredibly grateful and I know that this is a place that I should never take for granted to be able to be named to start to take a jersey. So if anything, I'm running on there just incredibly proud of the girls that I get to run on with and to be able to represent my family as well. It's not something I take lightly. So I'm very excited for us to take the field together today. Yeah, I'm so excited. Yay! You're debuting today. What does it mean to you to be able to don the sky blue and play in front of your family and friends at GIY Stadium? Mm. Yeah, it's going to be in the fields right now, but... I'm actually, I can't believe pre-season is over, to be, to be honest, first and foremost, but that's, that's going to be a very special moment for myself and, and for my family and I, I honestly, I, I was born and raised in New South Wales and yeah. to wear um, Sky Blue and our know, banners under the same as the mid, so that's a whole lot of history that comes with that and to be a part of that, that's, that's pretty crazy, so uh, I'm very blessed and um, I can't wait to take the opportunity. That's so awesome. I can't wait to run on with them. Yeah, it means a lot. I mean, I, I grew up uh, born and raised in New South Wales. Uh, my family was born and raised in New South Wales. Um, yeah, so it means a lot to me. Yeah, being able to like have your family watch you represent. Yeah, definitely. So my family, um, you know, being a Pacific Islander on the team as well, it means a lot for, you know, Yeah. Uh, 
we can just capitalise a bit more on our opportunities with the ball in the hand, but I think that you know we can reassess and go back to training and work on it for the next two weeks, and uh, in our next game, you know, really showcase our skills and talent. Mahalia said it best. Thank you so much. I hope that you enjoyed our first instalment and continue to follow the Super W competition and more importantly, the Warriors Files. Love yous. I'm teaching it to sit, look at that. Oh, sit, sit. <laughs>